What's up? What the what the faggots? Uh, come town for. This is uh, th- this American come. This American come. This is the big. This is the big one, dude. Oh, I know yeah. I said the last one was big, but this one's even bigger than the last this one. Is huge. This is a plus size. This is an Ashley Graham size podcast, BBW, dude. This is yeah. two, two dope comes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> two dope comes on Radio w, come. Uh, w come Y come W come Y C W C U M. Hey, this is okay. Um, so let's introduce ourselves, Nick. Yeah, Nick, uh, aka the Puerto Rican rattlesnake. We got Stav, aka hey. the Puerto Rican rattlesnake, and Adam, of course. What's up, Puerto Rican rattlesnake? Adam Friedland. What's going on? Yeah, everyone? we're the yeah. Puerto Rican rattlesnakes of comedy. <laughs> Uh, it's nice to uh, nice to have Adam back. Yeah, yeah, dude. great. Um, yeah. Yes, it's great to have you back, Dan. Uh, was, thanks, guys. Yeah, it feels great to be. Here. <laughs> it was it was cool having a guest, but Dan really kind of stunk. Yeah, Dan uh, wasn't as good as you, buddy. Yeah, that's how we feel for uh, sure. Yeah, we were like Wait, saying, can, "What's that?" Can I be real for a second on the podcast? I like uh, I know of course this is a one hundred percent real. I know zone. that we're this like joking around, talk. like. All right, you guys, like, I think poo pooed on me a little bit on that last episode. No. no, we didn't. What are you talking about? Dude, I got texts from people. They were like, first of all, you lied to us about being the host of Come Down. <laughs> <laughs> Second of all, your boys are roasting you, dude. Dude, you I don't You guys think were so. flat hand Brandon Wardell roasting me on the pod, and I wasn't even on That's it. That's not true. That's a I wasn't even lie. on it to defend myself. I don't know who told you that, but they're a fucking yeah, who liar. Was that? Name names, dude. I mean, they're friends of mine. People well, that listen to the podcast. They're lying, dude. We didn't say a negative word about you. We're glad that you're back. Dude, we... it's on. Okay, first of all, it's a podcast. It's recorded. You can check it. Like You can like look it up. What like, did we say then, bitch? Yeah, we didn't say anything. You said that I ruined the podcast and that I'd never be on no, it again. No, never. Maybe in private conversation, I've like maybe offered constructive criticism about your behavior. Look, you dude, never gave me constructive criticism. God, you just shit on me when I wasn't on no, the No, I've said a couple of times. Look, you need to understand that when you come in here... To the Anthony Cumia Studios at the top of the Empire State Building. This is the eagle's nest of podcasting. Okay, the don't, stakes are higher. Don't, don't put this p like make me out to be a PC pussy ass bitch. Don't make that's this all you about your political bullshit that's where you're you mad are, at. Bitch. No, no, that's this is bullshit, an alpha dude. male podcast. This is about this, this is, is about no. Males. This is about friends that started comedy together that are trying to fucking do a podcast together and not shitting on each other. They're shitting on everyone shit. else. We, like, didn't sh- we didn't shit on you. Okay. Dude, nobody, relax, relax. Nobody shit on you. I'm I can't hot. Even... I'm hot right now. And it's not... I just... I would expect... Dude, you're about to get banned. I can't... Honestly. Yeah. I can't believe you would even do this. Don't ban... You would accuse me of these things. Okay. Get Dan back. Especially Dan me. Back. <laughs> considering I'm... The, I bought all the shit. I'm... Everyone knows I'm the gear... I'm the gear guy of the crew. I'm the one that makes all this shit happen, and you're going to say that I did something to sully our friendship. Dude, I had... Um, when I'm, I went to B&H Photo, and I had to deal with those, that... You know who owns that place. You know who owns that place. I know place. who the fuck owns that place. You know Continue that sentence. I don't like Continue them. that sentence. Well, I'm not what going to. What kind of person? I'm not dealing with Just that. Just say you know what, what kind of person. Guys, you know what? Relax. If you don't like the way the pie... I'm leaving. I'm leaving. No. I'm going. Nick, come on. I'm man. done Nick, with don't be a... I'm, I'm leaving. Uh, Let's just I'm talk it out. I'm part of a podcast where I'm going to be accused of, of being so Dude, this is why we got a pat. This Stop. is why we got a pod. Because uh, if we have beef, you work I'm it out on the pod. No, if you have beef, you work it out on the pod. Adam, shut up, dude. Come on, dude. That's what pods are for. They're for working out beef, dude. This sucks. What dude, you fuck? got beef, you bring it to the pod. This isn't married. Dude, Nick is a shit. bitch, dude. He just left his podcast equipment here? Look, we have to do this. We have to finish this podcast. We take over. I am now the host of Dude, Cump tell Down. him to come back. Shut up. Shut up. <sighs> all right, I'm the host now. All right, all right, all right. I'm the host of Come Town, everyone. Hello, welcome to Come Town. It's now a Nick Mullenless podcast. Because uh, he's a this Nick, is pff, Adam. Okay, sorry. You know what? This isn't gonna work. This isn't gonna work with two people. I can't do it with you, man. I just don't think you have. Uh, Dude, you have we're what better there. off without Nick. Look, let's be honest. Let's just open the door, okay, to the Anthony Cumia Studios. Do you want Nick? Just, just open the door, and whoever's hanging out. We'll let them be our third co host. Dude, if you want Nick, you can. Hey, hey, it's me, Nick Mullen. Diarrhea, diaper, uh, diaper rash, diarrhea. My diaper has autism. Stop it, all right? Save I'm, it. I'm Nick Mullen. I, you need a my, third. <laughs> I'm not going to have you roast my good friend, Nick. All right. I would never. 
Excuse me, is this the Jew? Oh the my Israel? God! Oh, oh my God! Look who we have here! Oh, oh my God! Who? Who? Are you? Oh, hey, is this Seth? Seth Dickfield. Dickfield. Oh, it's oh me, hey, buddy. hello, boys. Wow. I'm new. Oh, oh, you have a seat. This is a great wow. time of the year because actually, Nick, who you know, you know Nick. Oh, Moore. I hate that guy. Well, you oh, know, is he's not here? Is he's he? He's my good friend. This is. It's actually. And I won't have you sully his name, but he actually just left. And we're looking for a third co-host, and it looks like you're the third co-host oh, of Come Oh, boy. Town. Oh, I despise him. It's, it's actually him. pretty amazing how every time Seth Dickfield is here, it's like a Peter Parker kind of Spider-Man kind I of thing. I don't know what you're getting at at all. I don't know. Okay. Uh, uh, that's crazy. Well, I'm here now, and I tell you what, I love podcasting. <laughs> that's great, buddy. I love it. I love, this, I love talking Seth, into dude. the microphone. What, go Shoot. Shoot. I'm, I'm, I'm all yours. It's good to have someone... Like I am okay. I don't want to talk shit on Nick while he's not here. Like he talked shit on me last week, but Dude, like don't talk shit about my friend. Go ahead. It's just his politics get kind of exhausting. Oh, I'm so mad at this PC. I'm so mad at this. You know, this. that's the worst part about him. I'm one hundred percent. That's what I like about Seth Dickfield. You know, uh, when I hear PC, what I think in my mind is not politically correct, but pretty cool. <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> that's how I think. I yeah, I'm proud to be PC, a pretty cool guy. Yeah. But, so uh, last time you were here, you were talking about Lady Ghostbusters. Oh, I saw it. I got it on uh, Torrent, but I donated money to Rain, uh, the ticket price for the movie. So women that are raped will get the money for the Lady Ghostbusters, which I illegally downloaded at my, wow. to watch at my girlfriend's apartment. That's and uh, I, it was great. Uh, I did, you know, I mean, I only watched the first five minutes, and then I had to, you is know. Is it true that they uh, that they vacuum them up into their pussy song? Uh, <laughs> is that how they vacuum the ghosts? That's one hundred percent true. <laughs> uh, that's how exactly how the movie goes. That's good. It's natural, you know. Uh, you know, and uh, what I was more afraid of than the ghosts while watching the movie was uh, the men in the film. Oh yeah. Because you know, what's what is a ghost going to do? You know, maybe That's scare true. you a little bit. A man, uh, well, he's going to do the wage gap. <laughs> he's going to do the wage gap at you. So he's true. not going to pay you mm. as much money. That that's is true. so fucking And true. I, I just heard, don't think that's fair. I heard you know, it is kind of messed up that the four female protagonists of the new Ghostbusters earn the least amount of money out of any actors on that film. That's oh, yeah. true. And that the original true. Ghostbusters were around in the 80s. Yeah. And so even adjusting for inflation, they made way more money. Yeah, yeah, it's true. And the female Ghostbusters had to do so much more work considering the increase of ghosts in New York since 9-11. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, can you, uh, so Seth, could you actually, like, you know, I, d I don't know if this is cool or not for a podcast, but could you give us a couple, like, good bits, like, that from the Ghostbusters movie, like, a couple lines that you remember? Uh, the, girl, the girl Ghostbusters one? No, I actually don't remember any of the lines from the movie. I put the film on, and then I looked in the mirror, and I pat myself on the back <laughs> for the next two hours, and I kept saying, good for you. Good for you, Seth. Don't let, those, don't let those bad guys on Reddit tell you what you can or cannot enjoy. Are you looking forward to anything else? It sounded you sound like you asked if this was the Juno Diaz reading. Um, oh, by the way, Seth, do you want snacks or something? Like... Yeah, we have actually we have like uh, chocolate. Oh, like is these M and M's? &M's? Oh, these are M and M's. Yeah, they're, they're these are regular M and M's. Oh, these are peanut M and M's. No, no, yeah. they're regular M and M's. No, they're. Oh, peanuts. I had some earlier. I can't have peanuts. Oh uh, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> these are definitely peanut M and M's. Oh yeah, no, peanuts. you. Oh no, I'm allergic to literally everything. <laughs> oh jeez. Uh, oh, uh, how are you? Are you feeling I, got, okay? I don't feel so good. I have to go get help. I'm gonna go look for help. I'm uh, sorry. Someone has to stay here with me. I'll well, stay here with you, but like, do you? What, do you have, like, an EpiPen, or do you have, like, I don't. I don't have anything. I just need to, people to tell me I'm a victim until I feel better. <laughs> Please console me. Please, someone tell me how much of a victim I am. <laughs> no, I mean, if you're allergic to peanuts, we, we need to get, oh, like, God, some medical my, professionals I feel my here. throat's closing up, I feel. Do you have, I like, feel an like emergency I'm being persecuted. Contact? I feel, oh, yes, it's in my wallet. Here, call my... Oh, I hate him so much, but uh, please call my cousin. Okay. What's Baltimore your cousin? comedian R Ralph Arowski. Okay, he, I'm calling him right now. Bring, bring. Yo. Yo. Oh, yo, Ralph. This what is, the fuck is this shit, yo? Ralph, why, it's yo, me. Why y'all fucking wake me up, yo? Wow, Ralph, how, you just showed up here? That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yo, I was just in the other room taking a shit, yo. <laughs> Anthony Kumia is my idol, yo. <laughs> I love the way he be treating them blacks on Twitter, yo. Dude. He got a real way about himself. Okay, so let's clear yeah, things up right now. What the hell are y'all up to, yo? I just had a peanut and I think I'm dying. Oh, my God, this about is, fucking Tom, yo. Ralph, you yeah. are... 
a Baltimore comedian. Yeah. And you're also cousins with Seth? Yeah, Seth, Seth Dickfield is my Jew cousin. Well, we call him <laughs> that. He ain't no Jew, actually, bloodline-wise, but we don't trust him because he wear glasses and he be doing, he be uh, eating bagels sometimes. He's just a Jew as style. He does it as yeah, style. Yeah, and honestly, that's even worse the way I look at it, yeah, <laughs> to, ha- to, be, to choose that type of lifestyle. I can't. You know, my outrage has cured me of my peanut allergy. <laughs> I can't believe you say <laughs> these things. Seth, Seth you're, you're back. <laughs> you're back. You're I'm all, back. I'm off the live. ropes, and I've had enough of this bullying from my, yeah, you from my, s- my ethnic wife. Cousin. So, so Ralph, do you find yourself in this uh, sort of a similar political bent to say? Yo, uh, first of all, yo, I don't be doing no politics, yo. I'm a moderate, yo. <laughs> That's, I'm on both sides. I, I see the good on both sides. You know what I mean? Like, I, I say, honestly, yo, you want to get abortions, yo, do that because who trying to wear condoms? I ain't trying to wear no condoms. Yeah. So you get them abortions going, but... You trying to be president after you had an abortion? No, thank you, yo. <laughs> you cannot be doing that shit. Like, yo, get them shits. But you can't be hold the public office after you got an abortion. After you fucking killed a beautiful wow. ass baby, yo. Wow. That baby That's could have played despicable. third base for the fucking Orioles, yo. I know, first of all, sports should be illegal. Second of <laughs> oh all, my God. all Take it back. never. The A's, never. A's, Ravens, Ray Rice was framed. My other cousin worked at that elevator, and he ain't seen none of that shit go down, oh. yo. Y'all ain't see the real tapes, yo. There should be a statue of every one of Ray Rice's victims. Sports should be illegal yo. except for Lady Soccer. Shut up, yo. Wow. Don't, wow. Don't, I'm being victimized. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, bitch. You know, if, yo, every time Seth be talking when we was growing up, we would just molest him, yo, Ralph. until he shut up. <laughs> Ralph. Ralph. <laughs> Ralph. Yeah? What? All right. I'm about to molest you, yo. I this don't like is, the way okay. you've been looking at me. Listen, the I'm the on, only yeah. host... <laughs> I'm the only host left of Cometown right now, and I feel like a responsibility. <laughs> yeah. well, how about is this? there some reason you need to go for I some feel responsibility? Nobody likes the word come anyways. Yeah, well, I it's, love come. It was a bad podcast. It's, we're doing a new podcast okay, I now. I just like that. For I, real comedians. Oh, wait a second. Is this, am I on this podcast, yo? Yeah. yeah. You're on you our podcast, on this right podcast? Now. Oh, my bad, yo. What y'all need me to do, yo? Okay, so Ralph, I'm just... Th- oh, okay. I, I'd like I you to be respectful. Irony. I'd like you to respect your cousin... Even if fuck him, yeah. even if he is fuck, fuck me, S- screw you, pal. <laughs> oh my even God. if he, he is doing whatever the <laughs> blackface is of Jews right now, sure. and that's incredibly all, offensive. I ain't got to no me. problem with blackface. Okay, <laughs> first of all, that's history, yo. How are you gonna take history out the history books? Okay. <laughs> All You've right, never huh? read a book in your life. <laughs> books is gay. I, I love will... books. I hang out at the library and I meet first of all, there. yo. First of all. I read. Have you checked my Facebook? I read The Giver. Thank you very much, yo. Y'all All see right. that shit, yo? The apple. In one scene, yo, the apple was black and white, but then it turned red, yo. Yeah, I only read the first three chapters, <laughs> but that shit's fucked up, yo. That's a metaphor, yo. I just learned what that word means. You don't even know what a metaphor is. Yeah, it is. It's a it's okay, a truck. He, it's a, he's it, Ralph is an imbecile. He's a grade A imbecile. Why, so then, why is he your emergency contact? And why did he show up immediately after you? you know, ate I was. Those, I told you. I was. Uh, I was. He at has the a very Anthony fast Camilla car. Studios. I have a very fast car. Yo, that shit ain't street legal. I got six lawnmower engines in there on top of my Ford Turbo Taurus. Yo. That's a special kind of Taurus. You got a turbo out Taurus. I got a turbo out Taurus, yo. I got Where do you a work? Where do I work? Yeah, yeah. I work out the Sher- Sherwin Williams out Glen Burnie. Oh, nice. Yeah, y'all need any kind of type of paint? Y'all tell me, yo. What I you like need? the Sherwin Williams logo. Yeah, cover the earth. Cover the earth with just, paint. <laughs> hell yeah, yo. That could be the new Cuntown logo, yo. Cover the earth with jizz. Oh my god. Yeah, y'all. Y'all, I took a couple Brandon and marketing classes over at SS Community College, <laughs> and um, it's got to be strong. Your Brandon got to be strong, yo. That's you, my take on it. Wow, I didn't. You know, Ralph, I'm really glad you can give us these kind of pointers. I just wish that Slav and Nick were yo, here. Yo, did you just fucking look at me, yo? I don't. I'm look looking at you. at you right now. So, yo, shut the fuck up. I'm Seth. a grown man. I'm. I am. You ain't no grown man. I am 47 years old. Okay, and you will not speak to me like this. I'm fuck tired you, of yo. it. Yo, I'm that's tired why, of being That's why bored. our uncle sucked your dick the most. All right. I I don't remember that. Uh, I choose not to. Uh, I yeah, you don't I just... remember that shit, yeah. 
He would take us to the summary zone. So you're and saying... whoever couldn't do the obstacle, whoever did the obstacle course the slowest got molested. <laughs> that's, how, that's how you train I champions. Have... That's how you breed champions I at have... this fucking Lasma, house. Yeah. Are you can't... telling me, okay, look, guys? I, here's my question. Okay, Rain is Ralph, saying, yeah. you're 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 implying that your cousin yes. was molested into behaving Jewish. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yeah, everybody knows that's how Judaism started, yeah? Well, I, you know, I wouldn't disagree with that. I just don't like the presentation of the facts. I wouldn't say that's incorrect, but, you know, maybe I, maybe I chose not to do the obstacle course that fast. Oh, uh, yeah, uh, that's the other thing, yo. In the back of the head, everybody knew he liked that shit, yo. Yeah? No. We would all get together. Right. Is there something wrong guys, with that? Guys, I know that Is there something wrong with that? Yeah, we Please would... explain to me I in know the, we're the least Lucy homophobic Goosey. terms possible. I know we're loosey-goosey here on Comtown, but, Ralph, I think you're really <laughs> heading into dangerous territory I'm just a by implying that about your cousin. First of all, the, history ain't dangerous territory. Historically, this is what happened to Seth. He would get molested after the suffering zone because he couldn't do the obstacle course, and we would all sit in the back of the room pretending to be watching Martin reruns, but really we was listening to him like getting molested and calling him gay. <laughs> that's it. That's history, yo. That ain't nothing that's wrong, yo. Open your eyes. Thank you. Anyway, what was you saying? All right. Well, I'm, Seth, I'm really sorry to hear about the constant abuse that you had to face growing up. That's a. Uh, that, Yo, that was just. Really he, first of all, he ain't grow up with us. That was just during Thanksgiving and Christmas. <laughs> oh yeah, Seth, where did you grow up? Uh, I grew up in uh, Louisiana. <laughs> oh, that's where you get your classic Louisiana. That's, accent that's for. this is a classic Louisiana <laughs> accent. <laughs> Everyone in Louisiana sounds like this. <laughs> You just sound like, geez, like a real have Creole. You, yes, it's it's just like, uh, you know, Aunt Jemima speaks this way. <laughs> Uncle Ben speaks this way. Do you feel way. like yeah, a yeah. got Here's a question, yeah. okay? Because you're from Louisiana, do you have more of a French perspective on things? Is that <laughs> is that like a... I would say so. I like wearing tight-fitted shirts and eating bread that looks like a penis. <laughs> yeah, uh, that, I don't yeah believe, pause, yeah. I don't, I pause, don't yeah. Should have to pause, yeah. My man gay still. <laughs> that I was, thought you was about to grow out that shit, but I should have known better. First yeah. of all, I love women. Yeah, I, right, It's yeah. both sexually and politically. Yo, I bet you've gone down on a woman before. Wait, of so course Seth, I have. That's, okay, just gay. That's said, how you have sex. Yo, I ain't never said penetrated. You love women, but you're decidedly anti-Hillary Clinton. If you I love am. women, why don't you support the woman that's Ooh, left for that's president? I, right I want First Bernie, but I would have sex with Hillary Clinton. <laughs> I think Hillary is a beautiful woman, and I would enjoy a body in a in a in a in a way yeah, that yeah, would result right. in both of us experiencing gross. a simultaneous orgasm. But Seth, yo, that shit gross. You yo. divulged to us that yo, you that had. Bitch Doo doo, yeah. Fuck you've, her. Yeah. You've had That's four so circumcisions. Misogynistic. Yo, that bitch got hair like my uncle Donald. Yeah. And you know what? I donated all of my foreskin to trans people so that they could create new genitals. Hey, what the fuck did you just say, Donald? Yeah? What a shitty name. You ever think of Donald? Yeah, don't talk that way about my uncle. Yeah. All right, sorry. It's just a bad name. I would never insult anybody's name, Yo, especially be an ugly Donald. Ass bitch, yeah. I think she's gorgeous. All right, first of all, let's be a little bit more respectful to women no, and our, uh, our no, other yeah. guests. Ralph, listen. What? We, we do Man, know. Man, you're making me mad, yo. I understand that Seth is probably one of the most annoying human beings that yeah. I've ever met in my entire yeah, life. Yeah, he was. But we can't. We got to respect other opinions and perspectives here on Come Town. I don't think That's so. the thing that I got upset about listening to the last podcast where Nick and Sav uh, did it with a fa famous comedian, uh, Dan uh, Soder, without me. Oh, they got Soder, yeah? Instead yeah. of you? They oh, got, that guy's good, yeah. They, they got Soder. That guy's so funny as hell. Okay, but like... He's a lot better than your dumb ass, yeah? You know what I like the thing is, 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 uh, is that they did... It's brown nosing. <laughs> is when people do that, is they suck up to... <laughs> Yeah, he much better, yo. They should do that all the time. Dude, Anyway, okay. what were you saying? I'm just saying that, like, they did the uh, Asian voices and uh, South Asian voices. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> and I don't know if that's Yo, something. I love... You I, that, about I think hour? that's despicable. You should never do a voice of any kind of race or gender yeah, that doesn't that, belong that to you. That you don't belong to. Exactly. exactly. I wait, agree wait, with that, Seth, too. But you should Seth, never make a man a caricature. You should never do that, ever. Okay, Unless we're in agreement. It's one of those tasteful ones that you get on Times Square where they make you look like a ballerina, but your head is very big. Yeah, ballerina, huh? I wonder why my man like that shit. My man like wearing two things. <laughs> it, no, it's a very athletically demanding sport. Have you ever seen the calves of a male Do you ballerina? Just talk. 
Yo, ballet, everybody knows ballet is just gay stuff, the shit gay people watch to get in the mood to have sex with each other, yo. <laughs> That's how it started, yo. The prince of fucking Russia couldn't get hard, so he looked at men jumping up and down. I, y- y'all think I don't know my history, my motherfucker? I know my fucking history, yo. Dude, but uh, I what think... What are you saying, though, Adam? Listen, I just think that, like, you can make jokes and you can make comedy without having to do belittling stereotypes of of different races. I mean, sure. I think we can... There are a lot of very funny comedians out there. First of all, there's like, truth to stereotypes, okay? Bill Mayer, um, John Mayer. <laughs> you know, these are guys that are really doing it without um, punching down. You know, they're punching... I know all about they're punching, punching up. down, yeah. I know about punching punching. Y'all ever get in a fight with me? You're, y'all, y'all, only hear, y'all only hear like fucking 10 hits. You only punch down. You only hear 10 hits. Well, I hit you. You hit the floor. Me and my boys hit you eight more times while you're locked <laughs> unconscious. Yeah, that's what you hear, my man. So I know a little bit about punching down. <clears throat> anyway, so, yo, this shit's fucking boring, yeah. What the fuck? Y'all got any fucking uh, chicken bosses out here, yeah? I don't have any chicken pasta. I do have chicken peanut. bosses. Chicken box. Bosses. B o x e s, bitch. Bo- bosses. Bosses. You don't know what chicken, chicken box boxes? is? Like a boss of chicken. <laughs> yo, I can't be around this motherfucker. Yo, there's too many Jews here. Yo, you're Jewish, ain't you? I am. Seth is not, and it's he it, might as fucking well. Seth, I just want to talk to you about. This I'm not caricature. Jewish. I don't know why everyone thinks I'm a Jewish person. What you're doing? It doesn't Seth, make any sense to me. Listen. I would give my last nickel if I never had. To, well, maybe not that far, but I would, <laughs> I would consider it if oh, I could shit. never have to put up with that kind of. Uh, I think the Anthony Cumia show is coming back. Yeah, they're about to um. Make a retarded guy get a boner. I gotta go watch. I'm that late shit, for my yeah. ninth therapy session today, so I have to leave anyways. <laughs> yeah, fuck you. Yeah. This shit sucks. I, I, I'm, I'm grateful that you got my emergency contact here, but I am so displeased yeah, with having you. to be confronted with my awful cousin. Uh, most of my family I don't get along with, but him the least, and his yo, molester me the least, father. Yo. What about my dad who molested you? Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm not gonna say I'm glad he's dead, <laughs> but. You know, it is uh, at least a physical relief that I don't have to <laughs> deal with him anymore. Well, anyway, yo, I got to get the hell up out of here, yo. I ain't, been, I, I ain't about right. to be... Y'all Ralph. will never hear me on this podcast again. I can promise that uh, shit. Probably me not <laughs> uh, either. I don't think... Ralph, I'm coming Seth, back. Seth Fuck Dickfield. you, man. I'm leaving, yo. Fuck you. Seth Dickfield, Ralph, thank you so much for being with us. Ravens! Ravens number one! All right. Um... I guess I guess it's just me in the studio right now. I I, I just want to thank you guys uh, for for listening. Um, I'm just gonna take it to break, I guess, and see if I can get Nick and Stav back. Nationwide um, warehouse. Nationwide warehouse. We interrupt to bring you an important message. Our everyday low prices are 33 to 70 percent lower than national chain. Nationwide warehouse. Nationwide warehouse. But for three days only, take an additional 10 percent off marked items. Nationwide warehouse. Living rooms from 198 dollars to 498 dollars. Nationwide warehouse. Nationwide warehouse. Bedrooms from 188 to 428 dollars. Nationwide warehouse. Mattresses from 24 to 99 dollars each. Feet sold and set. Brand new. Free layaway. Hurry. Nationwide Warehouse. Sale ends Monday. Nationwide Warehouse. At Nationwide Warehouse. Nationwide Warehouse. Eight convenient locations. Queens. Nationwide Warehouse. Bronx. Nationwide Warehouse. Long Island. Nationwide Warehouse. Manhattan. Nationwide Warehouse. Newark. Nationwide Warehouse. Lodi. Nationwide Warehouse. Asbury Park. Nationwide Warehouse. Phone 1-800-252-2232. Nationwide Warehouse. Nationwide Warehouse. All right. We are back from break. Guys, Nick and Stav have agreed to return. Hey guys, we're hey. back. Sorry, sorry guys. Got I, a little heated. I got you, a little upset. It got really weird here, by while you were away, and I'm just. Oh yeah. I Is just, Seth okay? Dude, yeah. Oh, Seth, Seth was here. Yeah, okay. Seth and his. Yeah. And who? Who were you telling me came? This guy from Maryland, Carl. Or Ralph. He was Ralph. Yeah. Ralph. Yeah, he uh, <laughs> Ralph he was a disgusting person. <laughs> hey, well, that's my culture, man. And, right. uh, and Seth and him are cousins, from what I understand. That's so weird. Yeah, that's crazy. kind of convoluted, wouldn't yeah. you say? Like, kind of have, a stretch? Yeah, it doesn't really make sense. <laughs> wow. It's weird that they both be here at the same time, <laughs> considering so you know they live yeah. so far apart. But, man, it's good to be back. You know, I need you, and I don't, want, I don't want to do this apart again. And I'm sorry for, like... 
being being a bitch, dude. That's, that's right, right, man. That's I'm, okay. As long as you understand, like, we didn't say anything negative about you on the yeah. podcast. It's like no, you said and something. We never like, no, it's that's on not the true. Okay. But you know, we accept Guys, your apology. We accept and it. I calmed down. I went outside. Me and Stav, you know, we saw this. <laughs> we were out there. This kid with uh, Down syndrome walked by, and I just, <laughs> it just always makes I me couldn't, smile. I couldn't stop. Yeah, <laughs> for how uh, proud of him I was, not like in a yeah, mocking exactly. way. Exactly. Me too. I, mm-hmm. It's it was felt so good for him that I calmed down. And, um, and the whole town told him he was Batman, right? Yeah, we all pretended he was <laughs> Batman. I went up to him and I was like, "You're Batman." And he was like, "No, I just pushed the carts here." <laughs> Well, um, it's good to be back. Yeah, yeah. let's catch up. Well, Pe- let's. Yeah, people let's... are going to think we're setting up another bit. <laughs> <laughs> we don't what do, do bits? bits. We don't do. You're you know, right. I don't We've know. Never people, done bits. people, I guess, have, have commented on that. They're like, you know, we love the characters, but there's no. None of us. I don't think we, any of us no. do characters. Well, we're working on a couple. Right yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. We we were thinking about we, uh, like. Uh, oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do the French one. Let's do the French. Yeah, one. we mean, came up with this character. Yeah. He's like, uh, so he's a French guy. He's French. Yeah, he's French. Uh, hello, um, I am from France. Uh, uh, hello, I am from France too, and I am gay with him. <laughs> uh, we are gay together. We I are am gay, and we are French, and we are here, and this is my boyfriend. And uh, we, we kiss each other, and uh, we have uh, one of those uh, bicycles that is like a, a double bicycle, but we uh, use the same seat anyways because it is uh, more gay. <laughs> Yes, well, uh, we, he's, good. Uh, my boyfriend is uh, fucking me in the house <laughs> while we are riding on I the bike. to with, fuck men with my penis. Uh, but yeah, that's the character. So we're working that's on the that. character that's the that, that we were right. working on. That's pretty good. I thought that yeah. went well. <laughs> yeah, uh, it was better that. in dress rehearsal, maybe. But I think that it went well, okay. For yeah, the we real spent show. the last hey. like fucking week and a half trying to figure out, you know, trying to make this podcast. Oh, so oh what about the what about the um what about the four twenty one? What, what 421? You know that the, the the look. Here's here's the thing. I know it's 420 <laughs> right. isn't a joke to me. You know I take yeah. that shit seriously, dude. Absolutely. But, okay. It's 420 somewhere. Because you know what? It's still a fucking crime. You know. That and is that, true. Uh, uh, people like us are persecuted every day in states like. Luckily, it's legal here in New York. Listen, so <laughs> listen, Nick. We can get we can get fucking 420 ripped up <laughs> right. out on the streets whenever we want. It's legal for white people, and pretty soon it's going to be legal for black people. Well, too. I don't care about that. <laughs> I mean, the first one, yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's true, man. Everyone, everyone, worry about yourself. You know, that's you know? the thing is that you can't put you can't put men can't put their laws. On a plant, okay? yeah, especially not for other white Thank guys. Thank you. On a plant, okay. Thank you. I think we're all in agreement here uh, about weed and gay French men. Do you guys uh, want to smoke weed real quick? I would love to smoke yeah, weed, dude. Weed. <laughs> Always, I'm smoking weed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is good, dude. <laughs> this is dank ass weed, bro. Oh, that's good. Get that binger out there. Dang, that's fucking weird. Get that binger, dude. Get that binger popping. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, (laughs) dude, you see the... <laughs> and uh, <coughs> damn, Nick, stop hitting that shit, dude. dude Nick, look at Nick. that binger rip, Nick, dude. stop hitting that shit. Dude, bro. One time, Nick hit a binger for a Hold week. On. I'm not even oh, lying shit. to you. No, let me do, I'm gonna do the joint on top of it. Oh, dude, you're savage, dude. Bro. Dude, uh, Nick is so savage. He just hit a binger and <laughs> then hit a, and then hit oh. a J without even blowing anyway, it out, bro. Well. Great start to the second half. Yeah, that's a good <laughs> sesh, dude. I think we had a good smoke out just now. Good start to the second half. We had a what good smoke out. We had a good sesh, and I think that's like what's important. You know, man, the thing about podcasts is you just do them. You just know? do them, man. You just, that's, how, that's how you build a listenership is you do them. <laughs> you get good gets, you know. Hot gets. I gotcha. asked my friend the other night what he liked about the podcast, and he said he liked the fact that we didn't Come on. try at all. Yeah, <laughs> I asked myself, and I, th- I thought, what do I like about the podcast? And because I, you know, I th- I've been considering actually listening to it after we <laughs> record it, and <laughs> uh, and then I thought, no, nah, that's stupid. No, um, I'm with you. But good news, uh, I got a friend from Russia. We're gonna hack Mark Marin's email and get all of his guests the week before they really? do. What the Ooh, fuck? Yeah. Smart. Ooh, that's Smart. nice. So dude. we got Chuck Mangione coming on next week. <laughs> He's going to talk about his French horn, aka the gay trumpet. 
That is a gay ass trumpet. Who's kidding? I am from France. I, I am a, 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 the, the gay trumpet. <laughs> I love uh, sex with men. We but play also the animals. horn with our penises. <laughs> we put it um, in the horn. All right. Um, no, uh, I guess here's uh, here's the thing we can talk about. Let's hear is, it. Uh, so I worked a job last week. Can't really talk about it. Uh-oh. Uh oh. <laughs> what kind but, of job? Uh, uh, I can't talk about it. But uh, there was some work. Yeah. Let's say I let's say I did a little thing where I had to wear a costume. He's and in pretend Ocean's Fourteen. I'm in Ocean's Fourteen. <laughs> um, I'm in Ocean's Nine Eleven. It's the movie <laughs> where George Clooney and Matt Damon have to blow up the World Trade Center. <laughs> <laughs> Ocean's Nine Eleven. <laughs> <laughs> just do that's great. That's, that's, a, wow, that's wow, dude. Uh, also, also national. Yo, bleep that out of the podcast because that's an ace bit that we can yeah, do. Yeah. An ace bit. You know that joke almost makes me want to get even higher, dude. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. <laughs> 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 let's break. Um, Cottonmouth Kings, baby. That's my favorite band. <laughs> yeah, mine too. <laughs> um, anyway, you oh, yeah. saying so yeah, job. I'm working this yeah. job and. Uh, um, I, I want to talk about. Uh, I've tried. I've, I've maybe mentioned it to a couple of people, but you guys uh, are you familiar with uh, Black Nerds? Oh, because fuck yes, dude. a lot of people don't know that they think Black Nerd. They're like, oh, you mean Urkel? And it's like, no, Steve Urkel was a black guy playing a white nerd. That wasn't actually right, a black right, nerd. Right, There's right, no right. black nerd that's actually like that. Black, Steve Urkel was a black face. Black, Steve Urkel was a black guy playing a white nerd, mm-hmm. and then a real black nerd is more like Stefan. <laughs> yeah, 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 is, yeah, is yeah. what Jaleel Survive. White thought was cool. <laughs> yeah. It's like he's like, I'm actually the cool Urkel. I like Street Fighter and Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> yeah. I don't wear glasses. I got contacts. Check out my leather jacket that I wear in the middle of the summer. Yo, That's like a black no, nerd. No, black nerds, dude. That's an annoying thing. Black nerds are like katana type. Yeah, kids. They right? love yes, Asia, They're all ghost dog way of the samurai. They love. There was a kid DBZ. They love. Avatar: there was, Last Airbender. Mm-hmm. There was a kid in my uh, Naruto in, in uh, at po- in po- Baltimore Polytechnic Institute, baby. Uh, fucking engineers, bitch. The Polycrackers. Uh, Baltimore that, Polyamorous High School. <laughs> Baltimore Poly. We all just sucked and fucked each other. Uh, it was a lot of fluid bonding. Um, there was a kid who, when he got mad at the teachers, would pretend he was going Super Saiyan. Oh, he would just. He would be like. Huh, huh, huh. <laughs> like it was like all right, all right, Jim, get the fuck out of here, man. <laughs> this is just fucking. Yeah. And there was also another black nerd who, uh, he was very gay. He was a black theater nerd, actually. Those mm. are the best. I he had also a knew close karate. friend in high school that was a black gay theater. Black nerd. gay theater nerd yeah. knew karate. This is you know Baltimore, and he would just like people tried to bully him for being gay, and he fu- one time he straight up roundhouse kicked like a thug <laughs> kid <laughs> in the hallway. It was fu- and then just did like a Z snap. It was yeah. fucking incredible, and he was. Notorious yeah. for blowing like straight kids in the fucking <laughs> upstairs. He was the he was the equipment manager, so he had the keys to the closet, and he would just blow kids. All well, the time. that was that was the guy I worked with. He was like a black nerd, incredibly jacked. I had to like change with him. They're like, all the guys change over here, and everybody else is in shape. I'm like, can I just change with the women? Is <laughs> there gonna be like a shitty body room? But he is. Oh uh, yeah, he's jacked. He's wearing a wife beater that looks like a Gold's Gym wife beater, but it says Goku's Gym. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's got like a drawing of Goku in the middle where the guy would be living in ways. And at one point he goes, he looks at me and the other girl and he goes, have either of you ever had the pleasure of watching Avatar The Last Airbender? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> fuck yeah, dude. Yeah, but no, he would have definitely fucked me up if I even, you know, remotely laughed at any of the things he said, <laughs> right, which were right. all great. Right, right, right. Whenever Stefan Urkel would enter a scene, just going back to that. Mm-hmm. I love how like I I imagine that the fresh the family matters like audit they had like different signs for the audience like laugh and like whenever Stefan came out they put the cum sign up <laughs> <laughs> and everyone would just be like ah! oh why was he so hot like <laughs> he'd enter and see people be like, hey baby Ooh! that was just Jaleel White being like yeah he was I so want to get tired. pussy yeah he was so tired of being a fucking nerd Brandon Brandon Wardell's gonna do that at some point. He's going to demand that his agents let him play, a, you know, a character he's that's not a, a black face. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's going to <laughs> demand a black face Twitter uh, Isn't dude, my shit is popping, dude. Mm-hmm. It's time for me to go black. I feel like I feel like Brandon's sort of doing that already, trying to trying to make his brand about. He's doing digital black <laughs> Huh? He's doing digital. What's going to happen to him when he like finally ages out of that? And maybe then, he doesn't. He doesn't. That's do true. It. Maybe he doesn't. Maybe he just stay. You know, he's a uh, half Filipino. He's got good. 
good genes age-wise, I think he might be okay. No, but I mean like I mean intellectually he ages out oh, of being Oh, no, he'll like never that. intellectually age out of it. <laughs> yeah, maybe not. Who knows? <laughs> nah, he might. Who knows? Who cares? Fuck Brandon. Um, Dude, Brandon actually is here, right? <laughs> oh, like, is he? Yeah, yeah. Where? You want to go get him? You yeah, go yeah go, get, get, go him? get Brandon, dude. Yeah, yeah, okay. um, make sure, just to have him, like, make, tell him that we don't do characters on this podcast. So yeah, just sure. have He's Brandon just come as characters. himself. Yeah. <laughs> any bullshit half thought out characters? Yeah. Oh, here he is. Oh, oh, uh, oh, oh, hey, guys. Um, <laughs> hi. Okay, um, so this is... Hey, Brandon. It's hey, us, your friends. Hey, Brandon Wardell. Is, so yeah. I was, because uh, we're boys, I was just wanted to work out new bits that I do. Oh, okay. Well, okay. this is, you know, it's kind of a conversational podcast. Sweet, but, dude. Okay. Yeah, and, and remember, this some? isn't Vine, so you have more than six seconds to do your jokes that you stole from oh, black no, people. Oh, no, no. That won't, that won't be necessary, my dear man. Um, okay. All right. And here's the first bit. <laughs> Here's the first bit. Go ahead, um, Brandon. <laughs> so, so Drake, so Drake was, <laughs> please, here's my first bit. So Drake was, uh, took a, Drake had a Pokemon and I said, what kind of Pokemon is that, Drake? And he said, it's a, it's a Charbander. And I said, Drake. You're savage AF, bro. <laughs> <laughs> You're uh, savage AF, bro. Yeah, you got zero shit. chill, baby. All right. Hell yeah. Dude. Can I try out another jug? Now I know why you're famous. <laughs> Can I try it? Go another? ahead, Brandon. Let's hear it, Brandon. So, uh, Justin, Justin Bieber was... Uh, Justin Bieber is in the news. <laughs> Again. <laughs> what are you even doing? Go ahead. And <laughs> it doesn't even sound like Brandon. <laughs> Jack, Jack, Jack come in and you say, Justin Bieber, is this your Pokemon or is this my Pokemon? <laughs> you sound like Miss Swan now. <laughs> <laughs> Br- Brandon. Brandon's, I, I, Brandon's mom is Miss Swan, I'm pretty sure. His no, dad's, on, his, a, his his dad's a, a GI lady. and his mom, I don't know his parents. I won't, I won't stand for it. We can talk about shit on Brandon, but not the Wardells. They are lovely people. Uh, you've met his parents. Yeah, no, they're great. Um, why? Did you go to his bar mitzvah? Yeah, I went to his bar Last mitzvah. year, his bar mitzvah last yeah, year. Uh, I believe I'm so, so, guys, 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 still in the room right now. <laughs> sorry, hey, Brandon, you're still here. About, hey, buddy, get out of here, man. I, I like that, that Brandon is just emo Phillips. <laughs> yeah, 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 what <laughs> the fuck was he in that movie? I one? met Drake <laughs> the other day, <laughs> and uh, Drake was lit. Yeah, Brandon, Brandon was just like the guy from the, <laughs> the, the B-52s. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. I'll follow <laughs> Anyway, the Snapchat <laughs> is a little love <laughs> place where we can rip off black Twitter jokes. <laughs> He's going to hear this and get mad. For sure. Yeah. He's we can have him on and we'll squash the beef. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's we just the, new, that's the point of podcast. You start the beef and then you bring him on the pod yeah. and you squash the beef, dude. That's what yeah. pods are all about, baby. <laughs> I, you know, I agree with that now. And I think we've come full circle because initially I disagreed with that idea but that they're for are. beef squashing. But now I, I you know, I... I think I agree with it, and I, I no longer think the podcasts are about like, you know, being funny or really having anything to say. Absolutely or, not. You know, no, 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 we'd no, be no. having fucked. conversations that aren't just like sort of cyclical and, and making fun of the same people <laughs> or, over and over again. No, I got sixty-five new Twitter followers. I am drunk on power, mm-hmm. and let's keep keep it going with this podcast. Uh, uh, I think it's going to be great. W- right now, I think what would be the best what the people demand is if we play a clip show of all the best moments. <laughs> <laughs> we should do the, the next one. The last three episodes. Um, some, I got, some of the hits from I got the past. some tweets about some people's favorite parts of the, our episode. Can we stop doing this? This is pathetic. Yeah, this, this, this is the fourth <laughs> one and we're talking about we're talking about it as if it's fucking anything Dude, i don't know i just ate a lot of bread so i'm kind of like uh i'm kind of sleepy well, let's i want to tell it. come nation come town just to keep listening because we have tons of topics issues discussions and <laughs> other things that are going to be coming up in the next 55 episodes of come town i'd love to talk about you know how's everybody doing fuck wise it is come town is everybody fucking? We all we already did that last week. Did None we? of us said fuck. There's no. Oh, here, Adam's uh, not girlfriend is here. We'll just <laughs> we'll just give her a microphone and she'll. It's Michelle, true. do you want to come on? <clears throat> She's been sitting here in the background the entire time. Someone thinks maybe we're we about could. to do another. She was shitty... trying to watch porn and yeah, no. There's now we <laughs> can't in, introduce anybody. This is falling apart. Everyone's gonna think it's a character. <laughs> this is fun though. Hello. 
So you don't want to... Michelle, just come on the pod real yeah, quick. Just, you have to come on the podcast because we got to fill 10 more minutes and <laughs> we need something. Here, you take my microphone. Oh, take take. So Adam, guys, this have... is my FWB, Michelle. <laughs> <laughs> and you Please don't use my real name. Um, her, that's not her real name. Her real name... <laughs> Her real name is. Well, Go, we, we won't say. <laughs> we won't say what her real name is. But so we understand that you don't want to uh, date Adam. Is that true? Not at this moment. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't answer for the lady. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't think so. That's good. No, no. Tell us why. I love this. This is great. Oh, let's hear why. Let's. See. <laughs> no, I understand. Adam is kind of a piece of shit. Kind of annoying. He's kind of annoying. Sure. Um, <laughs> what about it? Is annoying. This is great. Uh. I don't know. It just <laughs> doesn't feel like something we should do. <laughs> <laughs> but it's cool to like sm- fuck every once in a while and like yeah, hang out. Yeah, sex is great. Yeah, is I'll he good at fucking? That. I'll give him is that. Is Adam good at fucking? He's so I think, the happy I think he's, I think you don't he's have okay to lie. at fucking. He's okay? Like, what would That's you what give a cushion him? is feeling. A C I'm, plus? I'm in... I'm enthusiastic. I don't think I'm good at it. I just think I'm passionate about it. So he's it. like a... But he likes to cuddle afterwards. He's a big cuddler. I could tell that about him. Yeah, of I course. am too. I feel like we're in the same zone where it's like, I'm going to try my hardest, but that doesn't mean anything's going to happen. You know what I mean? It doesn't mean it's going to be a great turnout. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I know what you mean. But that's what I found that... Uh, so if Adam was better at fucking, would you want to be with him? <laughs> 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 be honest <laughs> grab a mic here Nick take Adam's mic fuck well, Adam no I think if you I had like an undeniable dick I mean maybe the sex is good so I don't want to date oh uh, interesting but no 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 don't give us that bullshit answer to, to <laughs> make Adam feel better but if he was like how so you're saying he fucks at about a 7 out of 10 right now <laughs> Right? Um, yeah. Six seven to seven. Six to seven. Six to seven. She bumped you down. Uh, six to eight. I mean six to eight. Six to eight. On your best day, you get you hit an eight. B's not bad, dude. But the one to ten scale the one to ten scale for men always translates directly to inches. <laughs> For yeah, women, see, it's I don't about really the care rest. about inches. I don't Ooh, think that really matters. What, what are you, gay? <laughs> <laughs> I love inches. Hey, this is great. Um, oh, yeah, I'm back on now, by the way. This has got to... I got to so, do this. But if he was a 10 out of 10, would you be with him? Um, <laughs> would he be... If he was better at fucking, <laughs> would it, like, uh, equal out how annoying he is? No, I don't think it'll ever equal out. Oh, okay. I think it's just I think it's just there forever. <laughs> That's so I good. I try to tune it out. That's great. So what are you let's find you a man. What are you looking for? <laughs> We've got a podcast listenership uh, of over forty five people, I think. Um I don't know, I guess somebody who doesn't cook me breakfast. <laughs> See, so is, you want to be treated is, badly. This is a major podcast flaw because the only way podcasts work is if you have a girl, but only when you just tell them to shut up all the time. Okay, okay, that's fair. All, all the alpha male podcasts. Can I myself for a second? You're not on camera. We don't have mic. another. Sorry, we only got okay. three mics. This is. Uh, you know what? That's twenty minutes. So, <laughs> hey guys, that was the second half. Uh, <laughs> You gotta <laughs> look. As some podcasts they know what they're doing. We're not just kind of like, you know. Hell fucking, yes. You want a good podcast? Uh, we got uh, our friends, sort of a sister podcast, Chapo Trap House. Yeah, listen to that. Which are everyone who listens to this is just people they told <laughs> yeah. to listen to this. Really? That one's, yeah, they're very funny guys, but they're also like, you know, if you're into like, have you listened fucking to knowing it? who the president is? They're smart, smart shit. Guys, they're not shit. dumb pieces. I don't of do shit. that. I'm not like a homework guy. You know, I'm we're just not fucking not, nerds, dude. We we're get, not homework nerds. We don't like, plan out what we're gonna say on the podcast. Yeah, <laughs> we just fucking get real and have a good time, and we we fucking you know what we do? We get 420. We get 420. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to also thank my friend with benefits, uh, M- Michelle, for being Which on is the not podcast. Yeah, thank you, Michelle. And I just want to say you bring a lot of joy to my life. Well, Even if you're, not, if you're not my full girlfriend, mm. I don't care because you still make me happy <laughs> when we're together. If it makes you happy. Oh, that's so, so good. So I'm going to just say that out there to the world and everyone well, listening. Is that Great. Cheryl Crow? I think so. You know what I was doing the other day is... Uh, 
Are you strong enough to eat my ass? <laughs> <laughs> that was stuck in my head for like six years. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you for uh, listening to Come Town, guys. Uh, follow me at, on Instagram at Stavi Baby, S T A V V Y Baby. Uh, I'm naked as hell, and I think you'll really like it. Um, I don't have anything else to plug because my career's bad. But yeah. anybody else? That's fine. I'm at. Uh, I'll be back on Red Eye on June 9th. Fox News. I'll Fox News, 4 a.m. programming. Uh, four, yeah, 4 a.m. It's on from 4 to 4.01 a.m. <laughs> Only in uh, American Samoa. <laughs> in Guam. Yeah, in Guam. Um, but, yeah, thanks for listening to the final episode of Come Town. <laughs> it's not the final episode. It's been and such I a think good this is going to sound run. good. Uh, it's been a great run. We've had, you know, three great episodes. Probably we'll be, the best run of any podcast. We're going to roll a, a best of next week, so. Yeah. Uh, I think we already we already made that joke. Oh, did we? Yeah, Fuck. we did. Next uh, week we're doing <laughs> next week we're doing uh, something a little bit different. It's going to be a little bit more planned out. We're doing we're finally doing my plan of this American Cum, where we're going to we're going to have a host. We're going to have three different stories about uh, American Cum <laughs> and uh and uh, we'll see how that goes. You know, it's actually <laughs> illegal to transport raw cum across state lines. Really? It's got to be pasteurized. What uh, if it's... <laughs> pasteurized, you just swish it in your mouth a little yeah, bit yeah, and yeah. spit it out? Well, you have to swish it fast enough that it heats up like one of those <laughs> yeah, yeah. Vitamix Louis blenders. Pasteur, dude. Yeah. You don't know yeah, the science? a French guy that did all these experiments oh, with cum in his mouth. I know a couple of French guys. <laughs> oh! <laughs> You're forgetting that we Hello? already, we yeah, already did know, the French guy. Hello, we were just no, bicycling. No, 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 stop, stop. Let's end it. We were ending. Yeah, yeah. No, we're ending it. This is that's the end of this. <laughs> Jesus Christ. My what boyfriend a fucking has his penis. <laughs> All right. Goodbye, everybody. Thank goodbye, you. Goodbye, everyone. Thank mm-hmm. you.